I am a mocha mom and I am back with a video on homeschool burnout. Now you could burn out on just about anything that you pour yourself into but I want to do a series of videos on what that looked like for me and what I've learned to do to come back from it and what I plan to do in the future to avoid having that happen to me again. I've been homeschooling for a really long time. My oldest is 16. Next year we're going into the application to college process, which can seem daunting and overwhelming. And at the same time, it's our first experience of actually launching a child. We're going to be quote unquote starting the empty nest process. And for someone who has poured so much of themselves into homeschooling and working with the kids, I, I think that I started to wonder what the new me would be like as, you know, I start to phase out of the things that I'm doing now. I began to feel as though I wasn't sure how much I had left to give to the ones coming after. So symptoms of homeschool burnout feeling overwhelmed every day, second guessing everything that you're doing, feeling as though things are not working out even before you've even tried it. I think my biggest mistake was really forgetting the reason I had chosen to homeschool in the first place. I mean, during the worst part of this season of burnout was in you know, looking at other options and really wondering why I, I chose to do this to myself, why I chose to do this to my kids, and wondering if, you know, all of it had really been to their detriment. And for no logical reason, because they're doing so well. They're doing well academically, they're doing well, you know, their characters are strong. Everything I had hoped would happen for homeschooling them has happened, yet you know you're burnt out when you're looking at positive results and you still feel like you're making a mistake, you're falling, and you can't go on any further. I've got 10 videos coming up. Be yourself, extracurricular activities, one size fits all teaching, comparing yourself to others. Why did I choose to homeschool in the first place? Housekeeping and homeschooling. Me time when to move on to a different curriculum, remember the big picture, and boundaries, how do you stay focused?